Hey guys, I'm Ronnie and welcome back to my YouTube video. Back with another player career mode video. And we are playing Salzburg first match um, of the video. And Diego Martinez is the first man on the ball. Can he get a goal for Chelsea? He tried to square it, but it's been caught by the keeper. Now Salzburg, and they, they tried to score as well. Mendy saves it. And now Chelsea go again. Diego Martinez is going to have a shot here. No, he's not. Chelsea still got the ball though. Ref plays advantage. That has to be a goal. And it is a goal. 1-0 to Chelsea. Is that Rich James again? No, it's Tino Andrian. Interesting. Tino Andrian is back at Chelsea. He doesn't have a real face. Although, I don't even know what his face looks like. I mean, I know him, but I've forgotten his face, to be honest. Salzburg with Enrique. And it's another good save by Edon Mendy, who in FIFA has not left Chelsea. And he's actually been uh, pretty good for us. <laughs> it's because of the fact it's 27 here. I mean, that's probably what we expected um, after his good season. Uh, but there, he's not able to save that. And it's 1-1. Salzburg have equalized through this young guy. He's probably like 21. It's Enrique. It's Enrique who scores. Chelsea off the kickoff. Can they use the kickoff glitch? Can they use the? I mean, I don't know what kickoff I'm talking about. This is real life. This is not FIFA. Diego Martinez. Can he score? Yes, he can. That was a very realistic goal because this is real life, which means everything that happened is realistic. And Diego Martinez has made it 2-1 to Chelsea. Again, Diego Martinez using his dribbling to get past that defender. And he's still going. Can he cut inside? Yes, he can. Can he shoot? Yes, he can. Can he score? Yes, he can. Can he get a hat trick? No, because it's not his hat trick, but he still can get a hat trick. Um, that's, that's the second goal of the game, though. It's a free kick for Diego Martinez. Um, not his range. You know, Diego Martinez, you know, he likes to shoot all his free kicks, but he does not score these ones. Um, close. How about the keeper, though? Another attack. Another Chelsea attack. Diego Martinez using his pace to get past all the defenders. Can he use his finishing to score? Yes, he can off the post. And it is 4-1. And Diego Martinez does get his hat-trick. By the way, guys, we're on the road to 500 subscribers. So if you guys subscribe, that'll be greatly appreciated. You obviously don't have to if you don't want to. But it's free. And it will help me out a lot. Thank you. Diego Martinez being subbed off. That's his time done for this game. He played pretty well. To the next, and we are back in the Premier League, and we are playing Nottingham Forest. Recently promoted Nottingham Forest. I mean, they weren't promoted last season. Um, I mean, they were promoted last well the season before that. Anyways, one 0 to Chelsea. They already scored quickly into the video. I'll put into the I don't know the match. Four now. Fournier. Joe Fournier. What? Didn't he fight? Wait, what? I'm so confused right now. I am the nightmare. K S I. I'm not the nightmare. I am. I am Ronnie. That's. Um, oh, I am Ronnie. That's what I meant to say. Um, first somehow made a comeback and they're now winning two one. So Chelsea had to come back from behind in this game to get um three points. Hopefully, Diego Martinez corner meets the head of his teammate, and his teammate puts it away, and it's two two to Chelsea. I don't know who that is. I'm not even gonna act like I know. Am I? Am I even gonna try? You guys might know him if you have watched the series and you. No faces and stuff. I don't know. You might know him. Um, it's Romero. We signed Romero from Spurs. Interesting. Uh, good ball to Diego Martinez. Who puts it away? Oh, no, he doesn't. He's at the post. <laughs> okay, I was not expecting that. One more chance. Can Diego Martinez put it away? Yes, he can. And it's 3-2 to Chelsea. Chelsea, come back. Making a comeback on the comebackers. That just doesn't sound right. And it turns out Nottingham Forest are the ultimate comebackers because they've came back once again and the game ends 3-3. That's the best result for us, but we'll take the point. Go to the next game. Which is an international for Mexico where we beat Romania 1-0. Next game, we are playing. We're coming off the bench for Lozano. Unrealistic thing is that I play for Mexico, but I'm constantly on the bench. Doesn't matter how well I'm performing, bro. I would be playing. That, I, hopefully they change that in EFC. Um, it's one 0 to Mexico, but hopefully they change that in EFC. I've heard 
that there's gonna be social media, but I heard about like the fa past three FIFAs. But I, I, I actually believe that it might be because it looked legit. Um, Fabrizio Romano as well. I've seen that. Hopefully, EFC is actually gonna be a good game. I've had people hating on it. If I'm honest, my opinion on it, I think they just need to give it a chance. People will hate on anything though. So, I mean, yeah. Mexico attacking once again. Diego Martinez, will he score? Will he pass? He's shot up to say he hasn't scored. But he did shoot. Um, pass him back here. Yeah. Pass him forward. And Mexico, can they get a goal? Oh, 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 yes, they can because Australia are absolute donuts and don't know how to defend. And they pass it straight into Adriano. Adriano. I'm not quite sure. But we've scored. Diego Martinez, uh, uh, full time, 2 0 win for Australia. What? I meant 2 0 win for Mexico. My mouth hurts a lot. I haven't been talking so much. Next game in the Premier League. And we're playing Southampton at St. Mary's Stadium. Hmm, 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 hmm. Still no. And Chelsea are on the tag. Diego Martinez with the ball. Surely he's going to put this away. He will. He will. He won't. It's been saved. Chelsea, once again, this time Diego Martinez is playing center back because Graham Potter is an absolute genius tactician. And Chelsea have scored. And full time, Chelsea win 1 0 with Joe Fournier scoring the only goal for the Blues. On to the next. The cameras are fixed to one man up against his former club. Will he make an impact live on EA TV? <laughs> Something in my throat, guys. Sorry. <laughs> Anyways, we're back um, in the Champions League. Playing AC Milan at the San Siro. We saw Mason Mount, who signed for us last episode, has left us last episode as well. And now we're playing against him. Diego Martinez scores, and it's 1-0. And already showing Mason Mount why he shouldn't have left. Well, they're not currently bottom of the group, which is sad for them, but good for us. As we're about to score and make it 2-0. Yes, Diego Martinez, once again, was there any doubt? No, there was not. Chelsea on the attack now. Diego Martinez fake shot and it's blocked, but the second shot is saved. Graham Potter, don't act like you have anything to do with this. Can AC Milan do something with this attack? It's looking dangerous, can. And he scored! 2-1. I don't know how Mendy has not saved that. But AC Milan are back in the game now. Emre Can, El Cano, uh, Jaden Sancho and Richarlison also there. Interesting. About to be half time. But can Chelsea do something from um, a last attack of the half? Diego Martinez. Can he slot it? Yes, he can. It's 3 1 to Chelsea. And Milan back 
having to score two goals to get on level terms with Chelsea. Diego Martinez showing how happy he is. I probably should have finished that sentence, but uh, who cares? It's the 90th minute. The cross is straight into the end of the keeper. And full time 3 1 win. If you're wondering why there was basically no second half highlights, it's because literally nothing happened. Because you guys didn't know there's like uh, adapted AIs. So usually, if you score on the first half, nothing will happen in the second. But if you don't score on the first, the second, you can score. You know, I, I don't know, this is how EA works. I mean, sure, that's the kind of, it mostly, yeah. Chelsea vs West Ham. See the actually called Tifo. It is a London derby, although not the biggest, because West Ham are not that massive. Uh, although they do like to say that. Diego Martinez's shot is over the bar. Not even the slightest bit close to going in. Now it's West Ham who are attacking. Velasco Isaac is there. I'm trying to get the rebound. I was reading the names. Um, Mendy saved. It's Sane who's playing for time. Interesting. His corner is punched away by Edward Mendy, who usually does not do stuff like that, especially not effectively. <laughs> Anyways, Diego Martinez tackled on the right hand side. Diego Martinez, Diego Martinez, Diego Martinez, Diego Martinez, Diego Martinez. Diego Martinez. What do you do with the ball here? Diego Martinez, can he score? To, can he make it one up to the Chelsea? Yeah, I guess what's Yes, he can. He can keep us falling on the floor. Diego Martinez scored to make it one up to West Ham. Against West Ham. Oh my days. Absolutely unbelievable. Chelsea off the kickoff. Diego Martinez doing some skills. Getting past Sane. Levamento's taking him down unnecessarily. Surely that's a yellow card for him. Uh, <laughs> the voice crack. Uh, surely that's a yellow card for him. And it is. And a free kick for us. And Diego Martinez will take it, not a shock. Question is, will he shoot or will he pass? He should pass. Hopefully he does pass. Looks like he is going to pass. He does pass. Uh, back post, far post, I meant. And it's out. For a corner. Azola, whatever those are. Banners, I don't know what they are. Corner, lots of power in it. And the head uh, is saved. Sorry, I, I, my English just broke down there. Just like all, all my friendships and relationships break down. Um, anyways, on to the next highlight. Diego Martinez. Brilliant skill to get past Levermento. Brilliant skill to get past the man. And, oh, it's a brilliant save by the goalkeeper. Chelsea once again with the ball. The shot is straight at the goalkeeper. Not a brilliant save. To deny Guerri. 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 Not sure. Now West Ham attack. Alexander Isaac. Jorginho. Isaac. And Chelsea clear. Apparently Jorginho loves London. Oh my days. Oh my days. Oh my days. And it's 1-0. No. It's 1-1. One, one. It's 1-1. One, one. West Ham has scored. If you wonder why there was like a glitch. That's because I paused it. While I was playing. Um, I don't know why. I've, I also subbed myself off. I requested to be subbed off. And the game is going to have to be simmed. Uh, from 1-1. We do end up getting the win though. Guerri scoring two. Martinelli score for them. Now we've got the last game of the video. We're playing Leeds United. Hopefully we can end the video off with some easy three points. An easy three points? Some easy uh, easy three points. With it, whatever. Diego Martinez's corner is up by the head of his teammate and it's 1-0 to Chelsea already. Jo Romero. Jo Romero, not Jorginho. Um, he's in the crowd. Okay. Another Chelsea attack. And he scored. Somehow. The keeper hasn't saved that. I don't know how. And it's 2 0. Giovanni Reina doesn't play very often, but he is a Chelsea player in the game. And he has scored. Funny how Chelsea. Um, a Chelsea 2 1 on Richmond are still there. And like the only guys left from my Champions League season. I mean, Thiago Silva is still there, but this is 2020, 
six, so he's retired by then, probably. Um, Chelsea, can they get a third goal? Diego Martinez was hoping to get one, and he does get one. 3 0 to Chelsea before half time. All three goals came from different goal scorers. And there's the full time whistle. It's a 3 1 win for Chelsea. De La Cruz scored for Leeds, wasn't enough. Wasn't enough. Oh me, yeah, you keep me close. You let me know that I can take you anywhere. Take you anywhere, anywhere. You ground me, yeah, you keep me close. Okay, anyways, bye guys.